New Orleans. Please wake up. I'm begging y'all. Please wake up. It is something happening outside that is trying to wake this city up. I didn't know if I was going to make it home just now. It is real. God is trying to tell us something. We are not listening, New Orleans. I need y'all to wake up. We got to pray and ask God to heal this place. Something. I didn't know if I was going to make it home this morning. I'm trembling. Oh, my God. Thank you, Lord. I'm, just, I'm thankful right now. I'm just trying to wake the city up. Oh, Lord. Y'all, we got to stop something. We got to stop all the things. We got to pull together as a city. This should be changing, y'all. This should be changing, y'all. Y'all, go to your door this morning. Oh, my God. I'm just so emotional because God has been touching me in so many ways. And I'm so grateful. Our whole city, you cannot see nothing. A building, a house. the end of the world and everything is burning something's on fire you're close and it's big but they cannot you cannot see nothing in new orleans oh there are so many accidents this morning god we got to repent and ask for your forgiveness and change this city so many people are being hurt. So many people are not coming together. So many people are losing people, dragging people down. Y'all got to stop this, especially us as the black community. We have to stop it. Lord Jesus, please, God, I'm begging you. God is touching me in a special way because I am being bold and I am bragging about God now, about Everything he's done for me and how far he's carried me, that's always been my foundation. My mommy and grandmother them instilled it in me. If New Orleans don't wake up this morning, God is going to come back with his rapture and he's going to swallow us up. I pray right now, God, that you touch everybody in this world every color, every walk of life. I ask you for your forgiveness for all of us. I am begging and pleading. Thank you for your grace and mercy that you have been carrying on all of us. Thank you for your darling son, Jesus, who died on Calvary Cross for us. He, on the third day, he rose again. I am trembling, God. I'm asking you to please just heal this place. Give them deliverance. Give them love unconditionally, God, like you have continued to do. But asking us to pull together as a city, as a family. Oh, my God. God, please ask you to touch everybody this morning, God. Wake us all up and know that we all have a purpose in life. And when you know your purpose, you can live better. All, we all have sinned and fallen short of your glory. But I know you are powerful and have all power in your hand. Thank you for everything you have done in my life. Thank you for what you're doing in everyone else's life. Thank you for carrying me right now, God, more than ever. Seeing my father about to die, God, I'm asking you please to carry my family and give us strength unconditionally. Oh, my Lord. I'm coming. I just, I'm, I, was, I was out and this, I never thought I would never make it home. This is scary. God is trying to tell New Orleans something. God, we thank you right now. We thank you for we thank you for just binding everything together. Thank you for your Holy Ghost, who's our comforter and ruler and guide. God, please ask in your mercy on us right now. We got to change. We have to change. Please stop trying to tear one another down. 
Pick them up. Help them. Help figure it out. Ask you to touch the mental health all over the world, God. Give them sound mind and body, God. Heavenly Father, ask you to cleanse our dirty, our dirty spirits, our dirty souls. Give us discerning spirits to know who's not for us and who is against us. God asks you to have grace and mercy on us, everlasting God. Heavenly Father, and when it's all said and done, we want to enter. All of us want to enter into your heavenly gates and bow down and sing with the angels. And the, the, oh, Lord Jesus, I'm, I'm, oh, in the heavenly, in the golden streets. Listen, y'all, I'm a child of God and I come from church. That was my foundation. I love the Lord because he loved me. He has done some amazing things in my life and I'm grateful and I'm going to brag about God. I have never been ashamed of him. I thank you right now just for everything you're doing. Please let us see this morning, God, as a wake-up calling. Let us see it as a wake-up calling. Because if y'all don't look out here and see that you can't see nothing, trust in the Lord with all thy heart and all thy ways he will. Lead your path. Please trust the Lord, God. I've been there, y'all. I done been through some stuff, but God has carried me all the way through. All the way through. And I know y'all know him. I know y'all know him. New Orleans, we know God. We built on it. Our ancestors taught us this. Y'all better pray. Y'all better ask God to help y'all raise these children. We don't have the grandmothers that we used to have. God, we ask you to give us the new generation of grandmothers and guide them, lead them, and teach them. Give them understanding. I thank you. I'm in my backyard, and I hope my neighbors hear me because I am not ashamed. I hope I'm waking all of them up. Thank you, God. I love you so much. I love you so much. Thank you for my family. Thank you for coming them, God. Thank you for all of everybody's family, God. Keep us together. We love you, Lord. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, y'all, please, please talk to God. Get your house in order because the time is near. We are living in revelations. It's so much happening in this world. We are in a spiritual war. Keep praying. Keep praying. We are at a spiritual war. We don't know what's happening. Y'all better get your house in order. Go and talk to God. Know the word. Get in your Bible. Touch everybody, God. Give us what we need, God. We ask you to keep on being in our lives. Keep on opening and cleaning in our hearts. Oh, my God. My pressure, I know it's up. But, God, I know that you are able and powerful and going to keep on helping. Keep on carrying me, God. Keep on teaching me, God. Keep on helping me to make a way. Keep on giving me the strength and the endurance to do what I do and what I love. Thank you. Thank you, God. I love y'all so much. I love y'all so much. I love y'all so much because I love God. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost, everybody say amen. I got to go and get on my knees and keep on thanking him. I got to go and say my own prayer now. That was for all of us. I'm trying. It's, it's, it's not right. Come on, son. Come on, bro.